Welcome to Pulpy Tamarind channel. Today we will see how to make tangy tomato pickle. We require asafoetida 1 teaspoon, 100 gram tamarind as pulp, tomatoes cut finely, powdered salt 100 grams, turmeric powder 10 grams, mustard seeds 5 grams, white vinegar 6 teaspoons, chilli powder 100 grams, dill oil 350 ml, fleshy, pulpy, ripe and sour tomatoes 1 kg. So take 1 kg of sour, uh, firm, fleshy, pulpy and uh, ripe tomatoes but not very ripe. Cut them into small cubes and mix them with 100 grams of powdered salt and 2 teaspoons of turmeric powder. Mash them and mix these things very well and mash them till they um, become a good mixture. So uh, this process will take about 10 minutes. So please mix it very well. The mix the tomatoes and the turmeric powder and the salt should mix very very well. So mash it all together uh, and then only we will keep them on the stove and prepare the pickle. So this is a pre-process. This has to be done. It will take around 10 minutes. Please uh, do it well. Switch on the gas on medium heat. Take a kadai and keep it on that and once it is hot add the 350 ml oil we are using till oil here you can use any other oil that you think will be good for pickle so uh, whether it's olive oil or any other oil which you think will be good for pickle so add that and let the oil become hot once it's hot add the mustard seeds which is 5 grams and let them sp splutter so once the mustard seeds splutter then we'll add this mixture of tomato salt and turmeric powder to it so now the oil is hot add the mustard seeds and let them splutter the mustard seeds are spluttering now we'll add the tomato uh, cut into cubes with added with salt and turmeric powder to it and cook it till uh, the oil separates and comes up uh, we need to cook till then because we need the tomatoes to be cooked really well so we'll wait we will keep uh, mixing it up and uh, cooking it till uh, the oil comes up once uh, uh, the tomato is cooked the oil will separate and start coming up so that's the stage when you add the next thing the next thing is a tomato tamarind pulp so for that we said 100 grams of tamarind you need to soak 100 grams of tamarind in two glasses of water and boil it for some time and then uh, the, the tamarind will get soaked very well uh, wait till the water comes to temperature room temperature then mix it up in a blender and that is the pulp here it should not be very watery it should be very thick the tamarind pulp also will take around 10 minutes to get cooked very well the raw smell has to go and it should cook very well and the oil has to again separate and come up so that's the stage when we add the third part so what is the third thing that is chilli powder 100 gram so we are have adding red chilli powder 100 gram which is very fiery and uh, so you have to add similarly whatever is available in near your place so if you are able to get the same red chilli powder fine otherwise whatever is available locally so red chilli powder um, 100 grams has been added mix it very well with the mixture let it all get dissolved and again the raw smell has to go and it has to get cooked so all this has to come together we'll again wait we'll mix it up well and we'll wait till the oil separates and comes up so that's the stage when we know that tomato pickle is near about ready so the time we have to wait patiently and this has to be done uh, so keep uh, mixing it up uh, so that the powder gets mixed up with the tamarind and the tomato tomatoes and everything becomes uh, a good great mixture so they all emulsify and come together as a great mixture so we keep doing this we keep mixing it up so after that it will the oil will separate and come up so then we know that it's done then we add the last two things that is asafoetida uh, one teaspoon so that we need to add which is again uh, something which will give a flavor and also uh, helps in preservation too so that and six teaspoons of white vinegar 
it could be any vinegar 6 teaspoons of white vinegar so we'll add this one after the other and mix it up with the pickle and then remove it from fire and straight away we'll start storing it in uh, glass bottles or jars pickle bottles so this is the stage last stage the pickle uh, is totally ready we just need to add the last uh, few things that is for preservation as well as for flavor so as a fritada there we take out and from we get this locally in india if it's available in uh, stores near your place fine take out one teaspoon of powdered as fritada add it to this and mix it well again add six teaspoons of white vinegar and add it up and then uh, switch off the gas and straight away start filling it up in the pickle jars or pickle bottles when we are dealing with glass jars or glass bottles we need to be very careful when uh, hot items are poured into such things the pressure gets built up and it will start breaking so we need to always keep it on a wooden surface while doing this so uh, wooden surface uh, is on what we need to keep the sterilized glass bottles and uh, pickle jars so they have to be sterilized very well so they have to be uh, washed in hot water and uh, cleaned up in hot, hot water then they have to be kept in uh, sunlight to dry and then there should be not a drop of water in those bottles only then they are perfect for storing pickles so such bottles we need to keep on wooden plank while filling this hot pickle this has to be something which you have to uh, be ready so before starting the pickle you must keep the uh, storage jars ready uh, sterilize them and keep them ready so you need to sterilize the bottles on in which you are going to fill the pickles so the bottles have to be uh, washed in hot water and kept in sunlight for drying there should be not a single drop of water or dirt in the bottle while filling the hot pickle uh, and it should be kept on a wooden surface while while filling it up and once it's filled up oil should be on the top and in the lips if you have any residue please remove it with the help of a tissue paper and there are two things uh, always while storing the pickle see we made a 1 kg of tomatoes and it comes uh, as uh, uh, more than a bottle um, okay so it will be more than 1 kg while as, as a pickle so we need more storing space so we are storing all this in one big bottle of uh, pickle bottle but this should be kept somewhere safe so that there is no access for everyone to, to the same and same similarly on the dining table we must have a small portion a small bottle or a jar which is accessible to people who want to eat it so this is the way we need to preserve it these are small tips to preserve pickle for a longer shelf life so please try the tomato pickle and the taste tomato pickle it is a bit hot and spicy so if you have a palate for that yummy tomato pickle is ready wishing all youtubers and variety viewers a happy pongal which is an indian harvest festival thank you for watching pulpy tamarin channel tomato pickle please subscribe share like and comment and press bell icon for notifications pulpy tamarin wishes all happy pongal